With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hi, the question is calculate the heat absorbed by a system in going through a cyclic process as shown in the figure. So we are given a PV graph and we need to find the heat absorbed by the system. Alright, so before we solve this question, let us first discuss some key concepts that we need to know to solve this question. Okay, so the first concept is actually first law of thermodynamics. First law of thermodynamics which says heat absorbed by the system is equal to change in internal energy of the system plus the work done by the system. Alright, the second concept is that in a cyclic process so in a cyclic process the change in internal energy of the system is zero because internal energy only depends on the initial and final position and in a cyclic process initial and final positions are same so the change of internal energy would be zero all right so the third concept and the final one that we need to know is that area under PV curve area under PV curve gives you the work done all right so these are the three concepts that we need to know to solve this question so now let us proceed to solve this question okay so uh, from the first law we can say Q is equals to delta U plus W as we said from the second point the change in internal energy would be zero because of the cyclic process so we will have q equals w that is the heat absorbed is equals to the work done by the system now to find the work done we need to find the area under the pv curve okay so now let us try to find that so the pv curve is actually a circle this is the circle and let's say it has some radius r the diameter of the circle is this so from the graph we can say diameter is 300 minus 100 so that is 200 so the diameter of the circle is 200 from this the radius becomes 100 all right so the work done is actually area under the pv curve the pv curve is a circle so we need to find the area of the circle which is pi r square all right so now let us put the values of radius pi radius is 100 so it will be 100 square note that unit of volume is centimeter cube and pressure is kilopascal so the unit of work done that we will get from this formula is actually kilopascal times centimeter cube all right if we need to find work done in terms of joule we need to convert this kilopascal and centimeter cube into SI units so now let us do that so the heat absorbed is the work done and that is equals to pi 100 square pi would be 3.14 100 square would be 10 to the power 4 kilopascal in terms of pascal would be 10 to the power 3 pascals and centimeter cube in terms of meter cube would become 10 to the power minus 6 all right so now this is in pascal meter cube okay and pascal meter cube is actually joules okay so pascal meter cube would become joule so now we have q equals so on solving this entire equation we will get 3.14 into 10 joules all right so i can also write q as 31.4 joules okay so this concludes our solution thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today